gonna be uh, attempting to cook today. <coughs> Got some rabbit here. We make rabbit poppers. Uh, basically, some baby peppers. Take innards out. Uh, fill them with some soft cheese. Put a strip of rabbit meat on it, and then get some uh, smoky streak bacon. A couple of rashers wrap round it, and then pop it in the oven for about 15-20 minutes till bacon's golden brown. Uh, should taste delicious. First off, what I'm going to do, I'm going to cut some nice strips of meat and then I'll pop them in that dish there. I'm going to marinate it for an hour or so, a couple of hours in the fridge, get a bit of flavour into this rabbit. Nice chunks, just like that, lay on top of pepper. I'll just strip that bone as best I can, as maximum amount of meat out as I can. So I'll just cut it into strips like that, try and keep it as chunky as I can. I'll try and maximise all meat off bone. Once I've got a dish full, I'll marinate that for a couple of hours. Right, crack on and get the rest done. So now I'm going to knock up a quick marinade, uh, that's all my rabbit, chopped up into nice chunky pieces. Got some of Sheffield's finest, Henderson's relish, some garlic granules, old black peppercorns, sea salt and some crushed chillies. Bit of a throw together marinade this but uh, I can't imagine why these flavours won't go together, they are just basics. I'll leave this for a couple of hours in the fridge like I said before. I'll start off with a few chilli flakes. I don't want much because I want kids to try this. Some sea salt. Black peppercorns. I like quite a bit of pepper. few garlic granules I can get in there not too much and some Edison's relish very similar to soy sauce there's a, a northern thing and a Sheffield thing this so and then just get your fingers in just mix it all together Smells delicious anyway, already. And that's it. Right, so that rabbit's been marinating for a couple of hours. So I've got my soft Philadelphia cheese, some smoked baked bacon rashers, and some sweet mini peppers. It's just a case of uh, putting it all together now.
don't want seeds in. I'll take all seeds out. Same with this one. Seeds left in there. Fiddly little buggers. as well. There we go. That's all you want to do. Right, what we're going to do now, just going to get some of this soft cheese, just like that, and just spoon it in. Quite generous with it. Just like that. Simple to do. Use my fingers a bit on this one. So it's as simple as that to start with. So all that's all peppers filled with cheese. Now it's time to put a bit of rabbit on top and then wrap in bacon. Rub it on top like that. So all being pretty generous with rabbit. Looking good. Quite a fiddly job. Sometimes you need a couple of sticks. Couple of sticks in. Oven's on about 150. Been on about 10-15 minutes. These are due to go in. Get them in there. 